Christmas trees in our homes and businesses make the holiday season feel festive, but a lot of work goes into getting those real trees ready for their decorating debut. Star City's Hannah Grace spoke with a local Christmas tree farmer about what it takes to get your Christmas tree to you. Making memories Christmas trees has been bringing Christmas experiences to Tippecanoe County since 2006. It's always exciting when customers come out knowing all the work that you've done all year and the customers are happy. Star City News met with the owner of Making Memories Christmas Trees, Buck Wagoner, in the morning before customers started coming out to choose and cut down their Christmas trees. Wagner talked about how this summer could have been detrimental to some tree growers. For some growers this year, it's been a, a hard year be because of, um, of lack of rain. According to Wagner, inflation has generally increased tree prices this year around 10 percent. Even still, there are many benefits to choosing a real tree instead of an artificial one. They're good for the environment. You can recycle them. Um, they provide habitat for wildlife. They uh, prevent erosion. Um, they are uh, they smell nice in the house, even though they might drop some needles. Although Wagner has seen a decrease in tree growers since he started selling in 2006, one reason he continues is for his customers. It's an exciting business to be in because when people come out, they're in a good mood and they're convinced, you know, that they're doing um, a good thing for the environment and also they enjoy the, the experience of picking out a tree and cutting it um, and taking it home. The National Christmas Tree Association recommends that you make sure your real tree always has water, keep your trees away from sources of heat such as furnaces, and turn off the tree lights when you leave or go to bed. Hannah Grace, Star City News, Tippecanoe County.